Welcome back to another cold email video. Today we're talking about Lemlist advanced features, the advanced features on Lemlist, which basically automate the personalization part. Because you know what we've been talking in all the videos I've been making, there's a playlist gonna pop up at the end or in the description below about all the cold email videos, the strategies I'm trying in all these videos. Well, the one thing we're always trying to balance is personalization with automation. We know that personalization is what gets us the conversions. And so we're trying our hardest to do as much personalization as possible, like with the Loom video strategy that I did the other day, um, which is working really well. It's one of my favorite strategies possible and gets really high conversion rates versus like just no personalization, which is just automated emails um, but we've always we realize that you know personalization works really really well we also don't want to spend hours every single day writing personalized messages to each individual so we're trying to balance personalization with automation and lemlist is you know has brought out all these advanced features kind of mixing the two trying to automate the kind of kind of like guess i'm going you know, I've seen some forums where people are saying, oh, you're just tricking your clients. We're a terrible way to get into a relate, you know, um, start a relationship with a new uh, client or prospect or customer. I disagree, you know, like we're just trying to cut through the noise by using, you know, whatever tools are at our disposal. And you can decide for yourself whether or not you agree with it or not. Or not. But Lemlist is coming out with a lot of cool features which mix these two things together. So check out the um, series of videos and subscribe and hit the bell button and let's jump in. So here's Lemlist and this is what I'm using today. I'm not sure, you know, what other tools have similar thing, but basically um, there's no, I'm not an affiliate to them or anything like that, but if you want to go for these advanced features, go for the sales engagement route. If you're just doing the cold email without all these advanced features, then use woodpecker.co. I'll put a link in the description below, but it's the one that I like the most. The problem I find with Lemlist is that it's super confusing. There's so many different buttons. It's so many emojis when you're looking, you know, all around. It feels like a bit of a UX mess. Um, whereas if you look at like woodpecker.co, which is my favorite, it's just super simple, quick to learn. And you don't want to spend, you know, hours trying to learn a new tool. So just go for woodpecker.co. But if you're going for the advanced features, which is what this video is all about, check it out. And basically the advanced features come with social selling so you can add actually linkedin sequences to it which is quite cool i might make another video about how to integrate omni channel so you're getting email with linkedin and how to automate that all with lemlist and you've got the dynamic landing pages which is what we're using here video integration calendar and chat and we're using all of that in this uh, specific thing we're doing here so basically what i have done is during the pandemic i created a concept but still it's completely valid now even if we're not in a pandemic anymore but basically everyone was looming each other talking on video having video meetings so i i created a concept where i'm having a weekly meeting with my sales guy in this case raul who doesn't work for me anymore but we were basically created a this is like seven months ago now so i'm kind of cheating here because this is not a new campaign but i'm going to show you the results i got back then but basically the concept is we use these dynamic elements within lemlist i created these are overlaid the over the top of the dynamic elements so i just basically screenshotted me on a on a on a zoom call raul on a zoom call and i integrated this um youtube play button here as well and lemlist has this feature where in the background it takes a screenshot of the um prospects uh, website. So if it's like phil at superlumen.co or b2bhero.co, check out b2bhero by the way, I'm writing a bunch of blogs on that, b2bhero.co, but it goes b2bhero.co or go to that website and take a screenshot automatically, which is kind of cool. Then it puts it down. I'm going to show you. So basically it looks kind of like this. This is kind of the email that went out. So as you can see here, there's this one here, which is exactly how it was there. The dynamic element is the background. And then say, so here's a completely different one and here's a completely different one, right? So it's kind of cool. It automatically puts the website homepage dynamically in the background here. And it looks like we're having a Loom meeting. We're having a meeting. We've taken a screenshot of their website. So when they open that email and they see their screenshot in the back, it looks like we've taken a screenshot of our face. This is on a Zoom meeting um, with their screenshot. In the with their screenshot and the, with their website in the background so it basically says hey first name we were just checking out your website in our weekly zoom meeting and we made you a quick video click click below check out so the concept is we have a weekly zoom meeting and we've noticed them and we've taken a screenshot to say hello and when they click on this 
they actually go to a separate landing page. And because I'm not a premium member of Lemlist anymore, I'm not using this concept anymore, um, I can't show you exactly where it goes, but it goes to a video. And I'm gonna show you this video in a second. It goes to a video of me and Raul talking. And then on, it's like its own individual landing page for this prospect, which again is kind of cool. So every prospect has its own landing page. And so it has the video, but the video is uh, not custom. It's just one video, generic video for everyone. And next to it, it has a little bit of custom. So it has their logo, which Lemlist again pulls their logo, and it has their name and a little message, which is not custom, but you can custom things like first name and company name, that kind of stuff on the landing page. And below the video, it's got a calendar embedded right there. So people click on this, the click for rate was really good. I'm gonna show you the results in a minute. They click on this because they're really intrigued. Like, whoa, these guys have like literally, you know, checked me out. They've got my landing page there. This is interesting, let's click on it. It was really high actually. And then, um, and then they click through to this landing page, they watch the video and they can book directly in the calendar. So it's really cool. So let's just quickly check out. I'm gonna show you the results in a minute, so stick around. But this is a quick, um, a little section from the video, so let's check it out. So I actually found the landing page, I just went to my email, but this is the landing page they get sent to. Here's the video, here's kind of an, uh, you can either have the company logo or you can pull their profile picture, just kind of draw their attention and it looks a bit more personal. And then you can go, you know his name, Anish, so thanks for clicking. It's kind of like a custom page, but not really. It's only custom based around certain elements. Um, would love to get on the, get you on the phone for 15 minute chat, blah, 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 video. And below it, as mentioned, there's the calendar. So you can book directly into my calendar. And here's just a quick part of the video. Hi there, my name's Phil. I'm the founder of Superlumen. Thanks so much for clicking on the link in the email and getting to this video. I'm here with Raul, the head of growth, and we've been, uh, we've been checking out your website and we really believe you could benefit from this, um, this uh, service we have, which we, we released last year. The service is basically Okay, cool. So there you have it. Again, just keep the video short and sweet. I think that video could have been a lot better. Um, I did this like seven months ago before I was doing loads of YouTube stuff. But yeah, I think it's all about just really briefly introducing yourself, pitching your, you know, why they should schedule a phone call with you. What's the benefits for them specifically? What's the hook? What's the offer? And then then you have a call to action, which is schedule a call because there's a calendar below the video so it's like schedule a call dude schedule that you know click the button below schedule a call with me and you know it worked quite well so i sent out 182 emails 67 percent open rate which is pretty good i'm not sure why the open rate was so good um and then you have only four replied but again the reply we're not trying to get replies here we're trying to get booked meetings because we're trying to lead them the the flow is open the email they get send the email they open the email they see the email and they click on the um, video which takes them to the landing page and then we want them to book in the calendar so we actually had seven people booking book in and scheduled phone call i i can't remember exactly which client came from this, I'm gonna dig down into that. But basically seven phone calls from 182 emails, um, which is a 3.85%. That's okay, considering this is fully automated, that's okay. And the one thing that I would say is really good is I had pretty much zero, there's maybe a couple, but very few, if not zero bad replies saying, leave me alone, because they see this custom element. They're like, oh, this is different, this is cool. So I got some email just saying, wow, that's really cool he did that. Um, more surprise, good stuff, and not many bad. And from the non-custom one, which is just a cold email, no, nothing custom, just like me writing something generic, I actually, even though I got a bunch of meetings from it, my conversion rate wasn't too bad. And I even uh, um, got, got a client worth many thousands from that. I got so many bad replies saying, leave me, you know, unsubscribe, I'm not interested, that kind of stuff from that. Whereas with this, I pretty much got none. So that's great. And a 3.85% conversion rate is not bad. We're always aiming for roughly three to 6% on a campaign like this. So 3.85% is not bad considering there's no personalization. Once you get the prospects in, we could be sending you know, thousands and thousands of emails, not every month, I'd only recommend 50 a day, but over the course of whatever few months, and there's very little time. Once you've created the video, once you've created the campaign, there's very little time input, which is then to have that kind of conversion rate is really good, because you're not writing 50 first liners or personalizing stuff every single time. So three point, having seven scheduled meetings on 182 emails, 
that's pretty awesome. I'm really happy happy with that um, and I actually might restart this again because it's great not time consuming at all and we can just get those meetings so I'd highly recommend uh, Lemlist advanced features and remember make sure you subscribe because I'm bringing out the video the final video to this cold email series which is going into the results of all the different A-B tests I'm doing all the experiments I'm doing I'm doing so many things I'm cracking my you know growth crack growth hacking my growth um, so definitely check that out, subscribe, hit the bell button because I'm bringing out those videos very soon. For more cold email videos, check out this playlist which is popping up right now.